Setbacks are a natural part of life's journey. They don't define us. It's our comebacks that truly reveal our strength and resilience. For me, after succumbing to the mass layoff in my organization, I thought that it was the worst possible start to my career and promising with a new job and the opportunity to do some interesting work in the AI domain. Hi, I'm Avnish Astana. In the past few years, I've immersed myself in the dynamic world of software engineering with internships at Amazon and Intel, and later joining Zoom straight out of college. I graduated in the spring of 2022 with a BS degree in computer science, earning a spot on the Dean's List every single semester. However, the journey took an unexpected turn when Zoom underwent mass layoffs, affecting me and many other recent graduates. With only six months of post-grad experience, I knew that I had to pivot to remain a valuable asset to companies. It not only equipped me with the necessary skills, but also gave me the confidence to interview with different companies. Eventually, I landed a position at ServiceNow as a software engineer. In fact, I became the first among my fellow grads who were laid off to secure a job, and I'm truly grateful. My learning experience has been fantastic. The one-on-one -on -one learning with knowledgeable instructors, coupled with the 24-7 support, made the journey smooth. The organized modules, breaking down complex problems into digestible pieces, allowed me to grasp some cutting-edge AI technologies. With support from cohort managers and flexible learning, success felt inevitable right from the start. I highly recommend this course. My long-term career goal is to become a knowledgeable AI engineer. Outside of the digital realm, I have a diverse range of interests, from coding and AI exploration to activities like hiking, lifting, playing tennis, and even indulging in video games. It's not about avoiding setbacks, but about learning and growing from them. Your comeback is always stronger than your setback, so keep upskilling.